Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are previewing the upcoming UEFA Europa Conference League round of 16 tie between PSV Eindhoven and FC Copenhagen. If you aren't already subscribed to the channel, please take just a moment to do that right now while we load. This fixture is going to be played at the Philips Stadion in Eindhoven. The stadium does feature on the virtual red patch that I use, so we have it for you here on the preview. Here's a look at the Philips Stadion in Eindhoven. PSV having a heck of a season, leading the air to busy at time of recording. Copenhagen lost striker Jonas Vinn to Wolfsburg in the transfer window, but still hit the good side. They had a lot of depth in that position. Alright, as the players complete their pre-match festivities, let's take a look at our starting lineups. For PSV Eindhoven, the line for 4 2 3 1. Aaron Zahavi, the Israeli striker up top. Mario Gotze, the German Messi, in the attacking midfield spot. Here are your players to watch. Ryan Hoven. And for Copenhagen, they'll have a 4 3 3. Wilczyk takes over for Vin, with Fischer and Falk on his flanks. Pet Biel, Stage, and Larigo midfield. For XC Copenhagen. We're about ready to get things kicked off here. There's Mario Glutza. Using the Europa League ball here. Under the boot of Aaron Zahavi. We are underway from the Low Country, the Netherlands. Holland. Home of the Dutch. Alright, that's it. Mario Glutza. Scored the match winner in the 2014 World Cup final for Germany against Argentina. His trade here at PSV Eindhoven for two or three seasons now, I believe. Dweke looking for Zahavi there. He misses the, uh, the header there on the cross. It's going to be a goal kick. Tenth minute, Copenhagen booted out for Fisher. Eindhoven take over possession. Van Gankel. Gakpo, Mario looks, uh, whoa, really pushed hard off that one. That might be a card. Yep. I don't, I wouldn't say it was unwarranted, but this looked like a pretty good shove there. And the German Messi. Installed the uh, latest version 4.1 of the virtual red patch, so getting all those uh, tips you get the first time again. Oh my goodness, off the post!
really a good job of holding off those defenders and keeping possession so he had a pass. Corner kick for Copenhagen. Pep Biel will take it. Keeper Ronald snatches it out of midair and sends it out to the Matrike. Mario Goods to Gakpo. Back to Matrike. He's looking for Rene. It pass is intercepted. Copenhagen around the move. So I forget they've already got a player in the book. That could become important as the match possesses. The presses. PSV in possession against Sangare. Head for Zahavi. It's a goal, 1 0 to PSV. Just before the halftime whistle blows, Aaron Zahavi, quick counter. Looks at a Sangare to Zahavi. Holds up just a step there. Stay inside. PSV are in the lead 1 0. That's the halftime whistle 1 0 at the break on the late goal from Aaron Zahavi. Let's take a look at our halftime stats. You can see it actually ended up pretty even. The early going, Zeindhoven had all the possession, and then Copenhagen settled into this one and had their share. But Zeindhoven will get the goal in the stoppage time. It's 1 0 as we kick off the second half. Not given. Oof. 
Close call there for Eindhoven. And her pushed over. Clever play there to just kind of flick it over the wall there. Wilchuk. Really clever set piece. Copenhagen. Shots denied. And over. A lot of pressure there from Copenhagen. Eindhoven get out unscathed. Still a 1 0 lead. has one slapped away. In stoppage time. Goats to Sangare to Zahavi. Your only goal of the match. Looks like he might have been offside there. It could just be the angle. Sixty ninth minute. Nice. Mario Guts. Shots off the mark. Bill check. The header here, really clever set piece from Copenhagen. Zeka on the shot here. Away by the keeper, and that's it from the Phillips Stadion at Eindhoven. If you enjoy the video, please give it a like, share it with your friends, leave a comment. If you aren't already subscribed to the channel, please take a moment to do that right now, it really does help. And again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. We'll see you next time.